Hello, I'm Tim Cockrell from Wise Media, and I'm here with Mr. Mohammed Al Bayati, who is CEO of Nakel, which is a very high-profile logistics company linked to Saudi Post, as I understand it, in, in Saudi Arabia. Thank you for joining me today. Yeah, I'm most welcome. Um, just to set the scene, um, could you give me a little back, bit of background on, on Nakal itself and how it's linked into the whole postal network with Saudi Post? Uh, in 2005, uh, Saudi Post decided to uh, do the, the distribution between its offices uh, uh, through a company who who used to, they were subcontracting to uh, some local companies and later they decided to acquire 51% of the uh, best company who was doing the distribution at that time which was named Hella Supply Chain. So uh, Saudi Post bought 51% of this company and renamed it to Nakel. And uh, from that time Nakel starts currently uh, with the expansion in other fields other than the Saudi Post, Saudi Post contribute to only 18% of the total revenue of okay. NACL. So we are doing much more than only mail distribution. But the mail gave us the, uh, the distribution uh, uh, and the network around the kingdom. So in order to reach to all the offices around the kingdom, which is almost 4,900 uh, cities and, and, and locations around the kingdom. Okay. And I would imagine there was a, a sort of element of trust as well that comes exactly. from, from companies and citizens. Exactly. Where in any country the postal, op the national post is usually quite trusted, like a bank. In, exactly. In some extent. Exactly. So if you have that, that must help. Exactly. Well. Now we are reaching to a, per uh, a high percentage of guaranteed delivery to a 98%, which is one of the highest. Uh, um, let's say achievements uh, in in all the country, on, in all the region even. Hmm. So this is a very high percentage of delivery hmm. on time. Okay. So it's just in time. So. Yeah. What are some of the specific challenges to to distribution within um, Saudi Arabia itself? Are there are there you, some unique Actually, challenges? currently Saudi Arabia is giving more attention to the to the logistics um, uh, they are building rail, new railways they are expanding into the uh, current seaports building a new airports everywhere um, building the uh, King Abdullah economic city mm -hmm. and linking it to the land bridge which is the the, the uh, railways so it will create a hub in the uh, King Abdullah economic city. And of course, all of this uh, complementing with the distribution uh, as a, as a multi-model for the air, sea, land, and train. So we are, we are trying to uh, complement the, the, the total logistics in Saudi Arabia. So currently is uh, really a big development in the logistics in Saudi Arabia. We think it's in the, as we are building now the infra better infrastructure, I think it will take us five years to see a big difference in the logistics in Saudi Arabia. And I would imagine that if you're supporting all this new development or having to work alongside the, the contract, the, 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 the organizations that are, that are creating this whole new infrastructure, do you need to up the level of, of technology, for example, tracking for making sure things arrive? That's right. Technology is, uh, should play a, a major role in, in this, yeah. when you, especially when you're making the, uh, the multi-model. Mm -hmm. So you, you need somebody who, who send a shipment from U.S. Through, through air. He should see it where it goes until the la uh, last last receiving home delivery okay so, so it 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 will pass through three or four channels sure. or links before it reaches to the home yeah. 
So he has to have a traceability on all of those so, so things. So end to end. End to end. Yeah. This is one of the 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 the, uh, the things that we are working on. Similarly, we have we are also working in the development of the clearance in Saudi Arabia. So the customs. Custom yes. clearance. We are yes. working very close with the custom to improve the clearance, especially for the small shipments. And what technologies are you using? I mean, are you using the sort of industrial automation, barcoding, or we, we RFID? Are, or? Uh, currently, in, in Saudi Post, they are using RFID. They yeah. start using RFIDs. But uh, we are using the normal tracking systems, okay. which is uh, the barcoding. Huh? Sure. Yeah. yeah. So um, uh, you can you can trace any shipments in our website, mm -hmm. and uh, it's available. Currently, we are opening an offices around the kingdom uh, for the uh, um, uh, doing the retail, the retail uh, targeting the retail sector. Well. Okay. We we already uh, previously we we master the the, the uh, business uh, sector especially in automobile industry we are 70 percent of the automobile industry in saudi arabia big mm -hmm. part of the electronic industry in saudi arabia uh, we are in close and so this is all parts shipment as well of course yes. yeah it's uh, the, the there is two types of shipment normally yeah. the, the what is called ltl and ftl yeah, so okay. the ltl which is the small shipments sure. less than trailer loads and which needs uh, time and precision in in the delivery so those items which is, uh, let's say categorized as a courier we are uh, into uh, uh, in, into the interest for those Absolutely for those for those yeah. LTLs yeah. yeah we are uh, considered one of the six companies of the courier in Saudi Arabia so in that case I mean there must be opportunities to maybe expand into the rest of the the GCC region exactly is, is that some, exactly. something you're looking at exactly now currently we open the the uh, uh, our office in Dubai where we are uh, uh, the uh, Saudi Arabia uh, opened a new free zone in King Fahad International Airport uh -huh. where it can deliver an express shipment from UAE Jabal Ali directly to without being checked in the border directly oh, to the airport uh, King Fahad bonded uh, shipments yeah. currently we have this facility uh, there only four companies are there uh, currently okay. uh, and Naqal is one of them so uh, we are working heavily on this uh, line um, even uh, we are uh, 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 now in the plan to uh, make our own warehousing facility in UAE and uh, opening in the other GCC countries. Okay, so you have the full distribution center as well as, exactly. as we, the logistics Exactly, and we are also uh, studying the uh, the uh, road between Egypt and Saudi Arabia, because this this link is also if it if it's improved, there will be a lot of benefits to both countries. Okay, okay. Uh, the the uh, the pharmaceuticals, for example, uh, sector need such a service uh, between between UAE, Saudi Arabia, and or or Saudi Arabia and the rest of the world pharmaceutical sectors is one of the most important uh, uh, sector who needs such precision and and accuracy of of, of the delivery sure yeah. because and often it's it's even temperature and care can uh, yeah and care of the delivery it's not just time it can be temperature exactly exactly of course in order to control all those steps yes. you need technology anyway sure. through the whole line yeah. so uh, and you have to have the technology not on the top level it has to reach to your courier your your driver it has to reach to everywhere right okay through the whole company and this is you have to maintain that the whole company is working together sure. in harmony sure. otherwise you will have problem you cannot get the 98% well, as you say if you have a one break or small break in the supply chain then all is the, lost there is a common speak in the in the saying that the chain is as weak as it is the weaker the weakest link. link exactly okay so well, that's you have good, to good, to good have it term. all strong yeah. well that's a great summary of it so thank you very thanks much thanks very much for you talking are most to welcome. me thank you very much for giving me the opportunity the progress thank you very right. much thank you thank you